Hey guys, day two of Camp Nano and I'm just going to tell you my workout for today. Well, yesterday, since it's day three, but I'm doing my video for yesterday. Today. What day is it today? It's the 3rd of July. Okay, so yesterday, apparently I wrote... Just checking now, I just had it saved, but... Decided to do Pooh Zombie. I wrote roughly 2080 words. Now, uh, Google Drive and my document kind of have word variances and things like that. So that's cool. That is cool. I got 2080 words done last night. Fantastic. Uh, especially since I start at 6 o'clock. Like, mornings are really hectic for me and so on. Afternoons, and I really like to just write the night times. Or sometimes in the morning, whatever really suits my needs. So, <coughs> okay. Hopefully there's no spot in there. So, writing is going okay. I had a lot of revelations yesterday, and today I'm just going to figure out some stuff uh, regarding the plane crash. I, for a long time last night, I was thinking I was going to have to kill a character, but after talking with my partner and a couple of other people, um, I don't think I would have to do that. I can actually be creative and find other ways to keep her alive. Uh, so that's good, which is kind of, I don't know, kind of a good thing, I guess, because I love the character. But I wonder if inevitably she's going to die anyway, because I'm very cruel to her. So after that, I just kind of wrote some notes down, made some sort of ideas come into my brain, because I'm god. Uh, and and then yeah, I just sort of chilled out and read a bit and relaxed and spent my night just sort of relaxing, I guess. I didn't go to bed until 2 o'clock because of personal issues. But today, uh, I don't know when I'm going to start writing, but I kind of have a different scene to write today from a different character's point of view to break it up a bit. Because it was pretty intense last night and... It did take me a while, like at the moment I'm writing about 600 words per half hour, which is okay. Usually I can write about a thousand or so, but 600 while you're not really feeling very well is quite good. Uh, I just went shopping to get some nice healthy food. Healthy, I mean chocolate also. I don't know if you can see this, but... Bad. Yeah, I have a bit of a stash going on here. Um, not really good for my teeth at all. But um, they're really cheap, so I thought I'd buy them anyway because I just crave chocolate sometimes, guys, and you know, I just can't crack that shit on the head. So um, today I'm going to make some more notes um, about the next scene I'm going to be writing and just upload this video, I think, because there's not much else to say. Uh, the two props that I did last night, and I'll try and put them in the description below, but they're very easy, so you can write them down if you like. The first one was stumbling in love, stumbling into love. So you can really take that um, any way you want it. And the other prompt that I picked out was uh, a character, ask another character, can I see you in the kitchen? Now this is hilarious because uh, I was on a plane, so I had to be a bit creative there and figure out how I could integrate that into a plane scenario because obviously you can't ask the character into the kitchen if they're sitting down on a plane. But I managed to make it work and it's with other characters so I was pretty happy about that. Um, just another thing to remember is that the good, well, a good thing to remember is that through Nano, hold a gun to your character's head, like literally or metaphorically, hold a gun to your character's head, and conflict will definitely ensue. So that's what I've been keep like telling myself, like if I want to keep going even when I'm struggling, just hold hold a gun to the character's head, make shit happen, like make shit happen, and it will happen. So that's probably like my what number one tip right now is just hold that fucking gun to your character's heads because you are a mobster and you will rock this shit so <laughs> anyway guys 
I'm going to go now and hopefully eat some chocolate, have some tea, and read because I have the Black Dagger Brotherhood book for calling my name and I like some sexy times so not enough sexy times in my book right now so yeah anyway I'm gonna go now um yeah I've been talking to you guys but I don't know what to talk about so chess rub okay I'm gonna go this is really weird bye guys